Hello guys, this is Gary. I'm going to do a package opening today. As you can see, I got this from LL Bean. It's their stowaway day pack. They claim that it's their lightest pack ever. Weighs in at 14 ounces and stows in its own travel pack. Adjustable waist belt, sternum strap, padded shoulder straps, and back panel. Rugged ripstop nylon fabric. Back panel with wicking air mesh, lots of pockets, including mesh water bottle pockets. Preloaded design. It is 1,343 cubic inches. Pack, pack size is 8 inches, 7 ounces. And I ordered their burnt orange. What I'm going to do here now is get into the package. Delivery was a little slow. And I do not know if it was because of Matthew. Just an invoice. October sale. Okay. Here we go. Beautiful burnt orange. That looks clear. Looks very nice. Let's see. When I was helped a friend move to Minnesota, stayed a little longer than I even just but it came in handy when I did little jocks to the stores. Really compartment. Good place to keep your keys, wallet, things you need to get to quickly. Let's see. Let's undo these straps here. I like the use zipper on this. Easy to get it access. Huge compartment. This is 22 liters. Little tag on here for your name and address. Another little pouch to hide away items on the inside. They're lightly padded, but it looks like it might be comfortable. It would have been nice if they did like Osprey and put a little whistle on the sternum strap. A little hip, hip belt. Nice roomy mesh on the both sides for your water bottles or whatever. Looks very well made. Feels light. It's nice and roomy. Feels like good fabric. It's not chintzy like I thought it was going to be for the price. Uh, actually, they sell this for $39.99. Or was it $39.95? Let's verify that. It's $39.95. And I uh, 
had received a catalog with a code giving me an additional $10 off. So for $29.95, free shipping, this is actually a fantastic buy. That looks like that'd be nice and breathable. It can wick moisture away. Probably won't wear it for such a long period that that would be necessary. Good carry handle, carry handle there. Yeah, I am. Yeah, I'm liking this. I'll have to test that out. Here. There's a little strap here. Put something on here, maybe a little beeping light for nighttime or something like that. That'd be nice if that was reflective. I might have to check that out later and see. It might have some reflection to it. Doesn't look like it, but that's an idea. Oh, look. The little pocket over here. That's nice. I didn't like paying attention to that right off hand. Zippers are nice, listen. No snags. And I like that they're plastic. I don't normally go for plastic, but you get caught in the rain, they get rusty. Yeah. Yeah, I'm very happy with this. I love the color. Let's see if it's here. Well, that's, yeah, that's good. It's feels a little difficult doing it like this, but it's, you can know when you place it, it's going to stay in place. It's got to yeah. yeah, It's nice and adjustable. It probably won't get a lot of use. Let's see. This is supposed to pack up into itself, I believe. Maybe that's what this pocket's for. Let's give it a try. Or maybe not. Let's see here. Hmm. Well, I'm not a hundred percent sure of how this is supposed to stow away within itself. But let's try this. I'll tuck this in on each side and bring this over. Oh, that seems to be working. Bring this in. And just keep on tucking. Tuck the straps in. Maybe that's how it goes. I'll have to investigate that, update it if it's not correct. But let's see. That's roughly 
eight by seven. Compress it a little bit. Even if that's not correct, it works. Okay then. Thank you for watching this video of opening my package I received today. Uh, I hope it was a little helpful. If uh, you want to take a look, here's the catalog. Let's we'll see if we can focus in on that. They have a variety of colors. They had the dark orchard, the mineral gray, the burnt orange, the pure blue and this limey looking green according to their catalog it's a five star item top rated okay I think that's it if you like the video please like comment, subscribe, share. I hope this was a little helpful. I'll have to uh, take an opportunity to try it out. Okay, I cut away there and I went and stuffed the stowaway day pack by L.L. Bean with three sofa throw pillows just to show you its shape and to give you an idea of its capacity it has a nice little shape to it very similar to a, an Osprey pack and then I went and grabbed my file here it fits in there nicely and there's still room put one on the other side or umbrella or whatever you want easy to get to See, open it up and show you the take these compression straps down there we go there's one two three and there was still room to, you know, utilize this pouch here, use this pocket here, stick anything in this pocket, and then you still had enough room to put anything you wanted here. A, uh, the base is just wide enough. Let's see. You can put a gallon of milk in here if you're out grocery shopping. Let's see if you can see, you still have room over here, throw in some other items. If you're out for the day in town, so yeah I think I'm going to like this pack. I'm going to investigate the uh, stowaway option and then uh, if what I showed you wasn't correct I will update this and maybe even demonstrate putting it on I threw it on a few minutes ago and it seemed very comfortable and the padding in this seems sufficient to maintain a comfort uh, for me I don't think I would need the waist belt here on depending on what I was carrying, but other than that, I'm pretty happy with my purchase thus far. I do hope this video helped you out on choosing the day pack, and that uh, you'll consider this one. If you're in the market to purchase a new one, or replace an old one. Okay, thanks for watching. Have a great day. Well, fellas. I have been exploring my new pack, the Stowaway Day Pack by L.L. Bean. And I, after my investigation, this pocket here is also used as its own stuff sack. 
I can't really see the camera monitor, so I hope this is in view. Now, bear with me. This is my initial try of stuffing this into its pack, its own stuff sack. So, if it's a little clumsy, do forgive me. there. Like I said, I can't see the camera monitor. And my first try is clumsy. Now I showed you earlier how I stuffed it inside itself and other than the shape it's pretty much the same size. So here we are completely stuffed. Once you get the hang of it it'll be a lot easier to do. Don't be deterred by how difficult that was for me on my first try. I know it was a little clumsy. It's got a nice little hanging loop here. So, um, this thing has some extra room in here. I might have it packed a little bit, but it zips pretty easy. And retrieving it should be a lot less trouble. Isn't that clever? Now this is the 2016 model, and you can actually zip this pocket and use it as a pocket when it's not stuffed. Again, thank you for watching and I hope this was useful.